So, hi, my name is Zaim Iskanda. So, this video will be about the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. Yeah, the Azerbaijan Grand Prix was first known as the European Grand Prix back in 2016. Hmm, Rosberg won that Grand Prix. Hamilton, I think, did not finish on the podium. Uh, and, um, yeah, uh, Checo finished. On the podium, I think one of the Ferrari Ferraris did. That might be maybe Vettel, I think. Yeah. So yeah, a few surprises. Yeah, it, all, to me as a best gen, always brings surprises here and there, especially the last two editions in 2017 and 2016. They were uh, 2017 and 2018. They were. An absolutely pulsating Grand Prix. In 2017 was won by um, uh, I think Ricardo. Yeah, I, one of the Williams completed the top three, and that's maybe Lance Stroll. Uh, second place was Hamilton, I think. Okay, last year Hamilton won Raikkonen and one of the. One of the drivers finished third place. So yeah, uh, yep. The last two years they were chaotic, really chaotic, and it was a pulsating race. Yeah, pulsating race. It's very unpredictable. There were a lot of big casualties in 2017. Hmm. Yeah, and 2018 the big casualties were from the two. Uh, both of the Red Bulls crashing against uh, with each other, Ricardo and Verstappen. Yeah, uh, yep. We will talk about the race results next after this portion of the stats of the track. So, as you guys know, uh, yeah, this is the fourth running of the Grand Prix, if I'm correct. 2016, 17, 18, 19, yeah, fourth running in three years, yeah. So yep. So yeah, there are two detection zones, one speed, speed trap zone. Yes, the speed trap zone is uh starting from the last turn. That is actually not a turn really. Twenty. 20 is a really fast kick that leads to the main street the, the two kilometer long main street before you hit the first braking zone and DRS activation zone for the DRS zone at turn 2 so yeah uh, yep. the, I think the two to, uh, the two uh, Force India crashed in the first lap of last year's race, according to the barriers. Then in 2017, it was Raikkonen and Bottas. Yeah, as chaotic as possible. It, it cannot be as chaotic as Hamilton getting his heat rest fixed and um, uh, Vettel getting a uh, 10 second drive through penalty uh, stop and go penalty and uh, Ricardo making a race winning overtake in the 2017 Grand Prix the third 2017 Grand Prix was absolutely pulsating to say the least so as you guys know this is stats about the track there are 20 corners okay turn 1 turn 2 turn 3 then turn 4 is the first right turn that literally ends sector 1 sector 2 is from turn 5, turn 6, turn 7 turn 8, turn 9 turn 8, turn 9, turn 10, turn 11 okay uh, those 4 corners are really tight corners they are about 2 meters wide each side of the track they, are, they have buildings around it this is a straight track so yeah 
10, 12, 10, 13, 10, 14, 10, 15, 10, 16, okay, 10, 17, 18, 19, and 20 are not really turns because they are really fast kicks back to back, back to back until you lead to turn down to the main straight. Raikkonen had a big moment out of turn 19, I think. That is the last corner. It's a proper corner. Turn 20 is a really fast, flat out corner that is not really a corner. It's just a curve, straight. Actually, from turn 18 to turn 20 is actually curve, straight. It's not a proper corner. So, yeah, it the the last sector is majority except for turn 16 all the other four turns are actually curve straights not really a turn because they go zigzagging through at, at tremendous speed i think oh yes the 2017 i think 2017 qualifying session raikkonen had a big moment and lost over two seconds in his final sector uh, qualifying for the Bahrain Grand Prix in eh, for the Baku Gr Azerbaijan Grand Prix in 2017 he made a mistake going out of 18 yeah he got a tank slapper out of 18 so he did not he did not manage to recover yes he did not manage to recover in time so uh, and he he did manage to recover in time but he lost a lot of time because of that momentary lapse lapse of concentration so it's the second longest track on the f1 calendar okay it's six kilometers okay uh first grand prix held in 2016 number of laps is 51 laps Sounds like the longest track is Spa, seven kilometers long. So race distance is around three hundred and six point zero four nine seconds. Lap record is held by um, Sebastian Vettel at one minute forty three point four four one seconds. Okay. So as you guys know, uh, Baku has how many corners? Twenty corners. Okay. There's the first three turns are left turns. Turn five is a left turn. Then eight is left turn. Then ten is left turn. Then twelve is a left turn. Then thirteen is a left turn. Then fourteen is left turn. Then 16 is left turn. Then 18 is a left curve. Okay. All the corners that I did not mention are actually right corners and a, a few right curves here and there. From turn 17 down to turn... Uh, from 17, 18 and turn 17, turn 18, uh, turn 17, 19 and 20. Then turn 4, turn... 6, turn 7 turn 9 turn 11 left 8, 9 right 10 left, 11 right oh that is a very tight sequence of corners they, they are doing about 180 uh, to a 210 kilometers an hour third gear to fourth gear maybe if i'm not mistaken so let's look at the race results from last year or let's look at the virtual laps first maybe you should look at the virtual laps first virtual lap <laughs> let's look at the virtual lap of this uh, the azerbaijan grand prix Oh, is it a video? Oh my god.
Okay. I oh man, it sucks because my my internet is in my room is utterly rubbish. Mm, scrap that idea of watching the virtual lab. Okay, now let's see the rest results. I'm getting all this information from f1.com. Okay, so as you guys know, last year's race winner was Hamilton. Perez completed the top three. Wow, Perez! He finished on the podium in 2016 and 2018. Raikkonen, second place. Vettel was third. Science was fourth. Leclerc, sixth. Leclerc's best finish in F1 last season. Okay. Uh, Alonso 7th, Stroll 8th, Stroll's first career points in F1, Vendon and Hartley completes the top 10, Ericsson, Gasly, Magnussen, Bottas, uh, Magnussen, 13 finishes. Okay. Uh, on, sadly, Bottas retired. Okay and was considered a finisher uh, Grosjean was stubborn Ricardo Hulkenberg a con Sorokin okay so was stubborn Hulkenberg Ricardo and Bottas were and Grosjean were the huge casualties of the Grand Prix but Bottas counted as a finisher because he completed more than 50% of the racing laps out of 51 so he was around 3 laps down but because he retired so he did not count so yeah uh, yeah so there were actually 13 finishes in total so yeah let's last year's fastest lap mm, should I do or, or the video will be I think the video will be quite long if I do the amount of fastest laps but I have to do it so yeah and I'm not surprised to see Botas Botas's name appearing yeah on lap 37 of last year's race, Bottas set a 1 minute 45.149 seconds with a top speed of uh, with an average speed of 205.525 kilometers an hour. Oh, in the last video, sorry, I accidentally said seconds for the average speed. So, yeah. So, I forgot to note that, sorry, before I started this video. So, in second place was his teammate, a 1 minute 45.4. 1, 2. An average speed of 205.012. Ricardo in third. Okay. Ricardo and Hamilton set the fastest lap a lap apart. So, uh, Ricardo's one first. A uh, one minute forty-five four point one nine, an average speed of two hundred and four point triple nine kilometers an hour. Sebastian Vettel, he had the the fifth. Position fourth. 
he had the fourth fastest time so on lap 38 of last year's race okay a 1 minute 45.530 with an average speed of 4 eh, 204.783 seconds Verstappen in fit in fifth in the uh, fastest lap standing for last season hopefully he can improve he said his fastest lap on lap 31 of last year's race was a 1 minute 45.7 1 1 seconds with an average speed of 4.204.1 oh, 0.316 sorry Raikkonen Okay, Ra Perez set the 6th fastest time On lap 51 of last year's race With a 1 minute 46.2 Zero 06 His average speed was 203.480 km an hour Okay, Raikkonen Okay, car 7, fa uh, fastest lap position 7. He actually finished the race in third place, uh, second place. But he set the 7 fastest time of the race last year. With a 1 minute 46.523 seconds. Okay. An average speed of 202.874 kilometers. An hour stroll in eighth, finish eighth. Okay, in the last year's race, he set a time on the same lap as Raikkonen and Sainz actually. But his uh, uh, stroll time was a one minute forty eight point one minute forty six point eight one five, and average speed of two hundred and two point. 319 kilometers signs on lap this uh, on the same lap also a uh, 1 minute 46.856 an average speed of 202.24 2 kilometers an hour oh, kebasangan uh, Rojan 10 fastest time for last year's race on lap 34 a uh, 1 minute 46.880 an average speed of 202.196 point Okay, sorry. Leclerc on lap 31 set a 1 minute 47.403 seconds. Average speed 201.212 km an hour. Okay, for Alonso, a lap after Leclerc. Okay, a 1 min minute 47.449 seconds. An average speed of 201.126. Okay, when done on lap 50, the same as uh, Raikkonen stroll and signs, but his time was a 1 minute 47.666, kilometers and our Ericsson a 1 minute 47.925, 200.239 kilometers an hour set on lap 51 Gasly on lap 38 of last year's race 1 minute 48035 200.035 kilometers an hour Magnuson a 1 minute 48.155 oh, 199.813 kilometers an hour Hartley, a 1 minute 48.22 point 
1.288 sorry 199.567 okay that was on lap 51 on lap 10 Nico Hulkenberg I think the field was heavy on but he managed to set the fastest lap of a 1 minute 48.876 an average speed of 189.506 seconds so last year's starting grid was actually headed by um, the Ferraris maybe ah uh, damn <laughs> Oh yes, Vettel, Hamilton, Bottas was in the top three. Ricardo, Verstappen, Raikkonen, Ocon, Perez, and Sainz, Com and Stroll completed the top ten. Stroll's first top ten qualifying session L was last year, I think, last year in uh, the Aba uh, Azerbaijan Grand Prix. Srokin. Alonso, Leclerc, Hulkenberg, Magnussen, Vendon, Gasly, Ericsson, Hartley, and Grosjean completed the top 20. Okay. So, actually, last season, Vendon got absolutely destroyed by Alonso. She did not even beat Alonso once throughout last season. He he was al always the number two driver. Oh yeah, I have a, a F an F one fantasy team, right? Mm, fantasy. Let me check first before I end, end this video. How many points I got for my F one fantasy team? Nasib baik dengan charge Kalau tak aku dah campak benda ni dah Not my phone I'm referring to my iPad Dah The internet in my room Is shambolic Like how Chelsea defends their goal. Sorry to Chelsea fans out there. But a shout out to so yeah. Hmm. Ay. My God. Ugh. <laughs> Symbolic connection in my room. Shambles, shambles, shambles. Jepala. <laughs> <laughs> because he's charging I got hook I got unplug the charger from the iPad uh, and it's at fifty percent right now <laughs> no why the connection is shambolic and it's quite slow too, so yeah. <sighs> wait for... Uh, wait. Okay. I, I think I have to sign off. Okay. So yeah, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Zaymi's channel. And see you on the review video of the Azerbaijan Grand Prix this Sunday. Good night.